It's time. It is time for God to judge every single one of them, dear child of God. It is time that judgment will be served. And God this day is going to arise in his anger. He's going to lift up himself. And because of the rage of your enemies, God is going to awake to judgment. And he will make sure every one of them, according to their deeds, according to what they have done, they shall be rendered in the mighty name of Jesus. They shall be rendered what they deserve in the mighty name of Jesus. He said he will give to everyone according to what they deserve. And that time has come for the Lord to judge them. That time has come for you to have your vindication. That time has come for you to get justice in the mighty name of Jesus. You were lied upon. You were lied upon. Dear child of God, you were blackmailed. They said the things that you did not do. But today, you will see the judgment of God in the mighty name of Jesus. The Lord is going to arise for you and He will turn everything around for your glory, for your honor, and for you to come to the place of rest in the mighty name of Jesus. You may have been asking, when would this whole thing come to an end? When would I have my life back? When would they stop mocking? Dear child of God, that time has come for the Lord to judge. That time has come, dear child of God, for the Lord to judge between you and them and you're going to see everything change for the best in the mighty name of Jesus. He said he will render to them according to what they deserve. And today, according to what they deserve, they would get in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. You know how they lied. Yes, they said you did some things that you did not do. Today, judgment is coming and God will judge each and every one of them. Yes, you are judged God faithful. You trusted him despite all. In the face of the situation, you stood with him. He said, God, I know you will come through for me. I know you would help me. I know you will turn everything around for the best. And today, God is saying to you today, is going to judge each and every one of them. Yes, because justice and judgment are the foundation of his throne. And today, God at risen, dear child of God, is sitting upon his throne, is sitting on the judgment seat, and is going to judge everyone, every single one of them, for the things that they have done, for the miseries, for the pains, for the sorrows, for the afflictions that you had suffered. God is going to make sure they will be judged in the mighty name of Jesus. God is going to make sure that everything that you deserve you would get in the mighty name of Jesus, and you shall be vindicated. In Jesus' mighty name. Yes, you may have cried night and day, asking the Lord, please, when would you show up? When would you act on my behalf? When would you fight for me? The Lord is saying to you, that time has come for me to fight for you. That time has come for me to bring judgment. That time has come for me to turn everything around and you will get your life back. You would rejoice, dear child of God. You will shout and sing songs of praises, knowing that the Lord has confronted them and the Lord had fought against them in the mighty name of Jesus. The word of God in Psalms 82 verse 1 says, God standeth in the congregation of the mighty. He judgeth amongst the gods. Dear child of God, that time has come for the Lord to execute his judgment against every single one of them. You see, God's word has made us to know that God arose, he stood against them, and he executed his judgment against the gods of Egypt, those who caused God's people to be oppressed, those who caused God's people to be in pains, those who had caused God's people to sorrow. God arose and judged each and every one of them. Exodus 12 verse 12 says, And against all the gods of Egypt, I will execute judgment. I am the Lord. Dear child of God, who are those fighting against you? Who are those contending against you? Who are those warring against you night and day? They are warring against your old being, your old existence, your entire family. They are fighting them night and day. They said over their dead bodies, would you know peace? That time has come for God to judge them. And what they deserve, they would get in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. For all the things that they have done against you, dear child of God, you will see the Lord show up, fight for you, and bring you that victory in the mighty name of Jesus. Abiram stood against Moses, and God arose and judged between them 
And what happened? The ground opened up and swallowed them all because they stood against God's own and God brought judgment. He cried to God. Moses said, God will judge between you and me. And God did bring that judgment. Abiram and Datan, their child of God, they suffered for the things that they had done wrong. He had given them time to turn back, but they refused. They refused to stop what they were doing. Dear child of God, you have given them time. You have been silent. You have been quiet. But they have been fighting against you. They vow to make your life a misery. They vow to make you suffer. They vow to cause pains. Dear child of God, and they have been afflicting you night and day. Every time you want to arise, they do everything to suppress you. They do everything to bring you down. Today, judgment will be served and you shall be vindicated in the mighty name of Jesus. You will not need to do anything, dear child of God. God who has built his throne, who set the foundation of his throne, judgment and justice will bring the judgment and will cause you to receive justice in the mighty name of Jesus. Justice you would get, dear child of God. You will get justice. It may have taken a long time, dear child of God. It may have taken a very long time, but you will not be denied what you deserve in the mighty name of Jesus. You will not be denied the justice that you deserve to get in Jesus' mighty name. He said he arose against them. He stood against them and he executed his judgment. He said, I am the Lord. That God is showing up for you today and he will change everything. Dear child of God, you may have sorrowed. You may have been in pains. You may have been crying, but today God will wipe your tears away because you will be vindicated in the mighty name of Jesus. The truth will be out and you'll be set free in the mighty name of Jesus. Those who have denied you your blessings because of the fact that they were blindfolded. They were blindfolded with lies. They were told things that you did not do. Your child of God, today you shall receive justice. You shall be vindicated and all the blessings, the honor, the praises that you deserve, you are going to get in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. He simply said, God will judge between you and me. And God did bring that judgment. Dear child of God today, God will judge between you and them. God will judge and everything you have done right shall be brought to the open in the mighty name of Jesus. And for what they did deserve, dear child of God, they will get in the full proportion in the mighty name of Jesus. Except they repent today. Except they stop their evil ways and practices. Except they turn back to God. Dear child of God, except they stop being wicked. You see, they were pursuing God's people. And God arose and made war against the people pursuing them. God arose and made sure their life came to the place of rest. God is going to arise for you and he will bring you to your place of rest in the mighty name of Jesus. So cry no more, dear child of God, for you will get the justice that you deserve in the mighty name of Jesus. And the judgment that should go to them, they will get in Jesus' mighty name and they will not be able to escape it in the mighty name of Jesus. So you don't need to fight anymore. You don't need to burden yourself anymore. Just go to God like Moses did and say to him, God, please judge. Judge between me and them. You have seen my situations. You have seen my wanderings. You have seen my sufferings. You have seen my pains. You have seen my affliction. You have seen the things that they said I did that I did not do. You have seen the reason I have been suffering unjustly for the things I did not do wrong. Please vindicate me. Please bring the truth out and dear child of god i want you to know you shall be vindicated and at the same time you will get justice justice will be served and the judgment that they deserve they are going to get in the mighty name of jesus it may have taken a long time but do not worry the judgment will come and every single one of them will pay dearly they will pay heavily for the things that they had done you had endured, you had fought the good fight, you had waited for this day to come. And dear child of God, this is an assurance that the day will come, the day of your vindication, the day that you'll be set free, the day that you will be told, go 
the day that you'll be told you are free the day that you'll be told all of the allegations the day that you'll be told all the charges against you are dropped dear child of god this will happen that day has come that time has come for you to testify of how the lord brought justice to you of how the lord brought his verdict of how the lord sat upon his throne the throne that is founded in justice and judgment and brought you that judgment that you deserve you are going to testify of the goodness of god and you will say forever yahweh reigns the god that has brought me victories in jesus mighty name amen it is well with you beloved god bless you and shalom